Jamie, take off the hood. Um, okay, let me just remember how to do Minecraft. Um, hey! Look around you, what do you see? Oh! It's my lighthouse! I made that about a million years ago. You'll find it is actually almost exactly three years. Is it really? Yep. Oh my god, I'm not even sure what version of Minecraft this was. Uh, it was a beta 1.5, actually. So this is the first, the first multiplayer world we ever played on in Minecraft. Started it in April 2011. The version was beta 1.5 at the time. Yeah, this was this was the big one, wasn't it? Where we built absolutely loads of stuff. Oh, that lighthouse is... I'm so impressed with my own building skills. It's, it's beautiful. So the plan for this evening is to basically go on a world tour. Let's start by going into the house. Right, so I'm following you. Come back! This, is, this has been a while, I can't remember where things are. It has. Uh, oh, this one. We have to go in this way, I'm afraid. Oh yeah, this is offensive. not ideal, is it? <laughs> There's a trapdoor. Oh, I don't remember the trapdoor. Don't remember much about this. <laughs> this is the ranch. This is the original ranch, isn't it? This is the ranch. Come inside. Let's... Uh... Oh, this is um, it's, it's a bit flaky. The, the doors are not ideal. <laughs> yeah, the, the doors have gone a bit weird since we last played, but this is to be expected. So, so come and stand in this room. So this building was not once so big. It started off as a small wooden cube, and I think where we're standing now is probably the site of where the original house was. So this is a good place to, uh, to fill our glasses, I think. So what are you drinking tonight, Jamie? Oh, um, well, I kind of like had to run off to an all-night toffee because um, <laughs> I panicked. Um, so I've got like some fairly um, um, not quite such exotic beers that I'm sure you've got. Um, uh, the, the one, um, the first one I've got is uh, Whitstable Bay by the Faversham Steam Brewery, uh, and it's their pale ale. Very nice. Uh, what I've got um, is my my local friendly beer place. Uh, they're actually doing a bit of a special on Welsh beers at the moment. Oh. So I've, I've got a couple of IPAs from Welsh breweries. This one is uh, the Celtic Experience Apparition IPA. So I'm going to fill my glass. So the first thing I think we need to do is see if there's some uh, some doings for some armour and weapons in here. Because uh, we're not in peaceful mode. So we want to be a little who bit is, protected. Who, yeah. Oh look, we've got cake! Oh yes, we, 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 we made ourselves cake as um, a celebration. For doing things. Oh, let me turn around. Let me turn around. Yeah. I'm over here. So, yeah, there's a cake in honour of the uh, ranch to chalet railroad. This one's in honour of our first trip to the Nether. Oh, and uh, our first dungeon capture. We've eaten this one. This was when we um, really went big on the Minecraft. Uh, the um, the the minecarts, wasn't it? Indeed. We long, long we'll have a look at that a little bit later. So I'm actually a bit hungry, so I'm going to eat some of this if that's all right. Oh, go ahead. Better see if there's some air. Uh, oh, it's oh. raining. Oh. So here's our storage system, all nicely labelled. I seem beans. to remember this was your labelling, wasn't it? You like your labelling. Yeah. Oh, look at that, and the pork chops aren't stacked. What? <gasps> Stack them at once. Oh, there's some armour. Oh, that's, no, I've actually got some armour. I'm quite sure where I got the armour from. Okay, I'm going to put the armour on. Some coal. Cook myself up a couple half, of pork chops. This armour is half broken from some adventure many years ago. I wonder if I left any armour in my bedroom. Oh, oh we have bedrooms. A leather tunic. Uh, uh, where's my bedroom? Which one's mine? Uh, hey. It's to the left. No, oh. I'm actually pressing the wrong button. Oh, here we go. Um, there's a sh I've got a shovel. Woohoo! Well, thank God I opened that chest. Kung Fu picture. There's yeah. some iron down here, so uh, I think it's going to be iron armour today. Oh, it's really raining. I'm sure this rain's more excessive than it used to be. Really coming down. Do you need some iron armour? I have... What do I have? I have iron armour. Okay. I'll pop it back in here then. Yeah. <laughs> so... As I say, this house started off much smaller. 
It was extended in various ways, including this lovely storage room. I remember putting, I remember putting the window in. Ah, uh, yes. I thought how exotic to have a nice ceiling to floor uh, window. Given that it's night time, shall we uh, use the beds? We shall. Oh, oh I'm still trying to use the um, uh, starbound buttons here. <laughs> Um, okay. uh, one thing I should point out I've got is I've, I've got a clipboard because seeing as I'm your tour guide I've got this clipboard here that I can wave in the air so you can follow <laughs> me so the first place I'd like to go is, is the cave that we visited on our first day wow which I believe you remember this stuff? I can't remember a thing about this well the thing you have to remember is that uh, I actually wrote a blog at the time so, so I've been able to use those notes to uh, to write a little agenda for today's tour. Oh, some bones. Found some bones. We're already ahead. Yeah, sorry. Moving off a bit quickly. So just over here, a staircase goes down underneath the beach into here, oh. the first cave. We walled it off and everything. Yeah, I think this is this is probably the first place I died on this map. I think a skeleton came <laughs> in here. Let's keep going down. More beds. We're not going to go all the way into the cave. Uh, just uh, Was this just a regular cave then? Well, there was a, a zombie dungeon down here. Wow. But here, here's a little, one of our little home away from homes. Oh, you tiny farm. Look at it. <laughs> and there's some wood and some coal. We left this here as a kind of little emergency backup kit in case we ever needed it. Look, there's, only, there's two bits of wheat growing, but not the third one, so you can't even make a loaf of bread out of this. <laughs> this is one of our very early efforts, wasn't it, I suppose? Well, yeah. I think these days our farm, these days our farms are about 10 acres by 10 acres. Yeah. 10 acres by 10? I don't know. I don't know measurements of land. Big. That was, that's the word I'm looking for. Somewhere down here, I think you also found our first diamonds, but I'm guessing you won't be able to remember the precise location. Oh, it was a, it was just over. No, I don't know. I have no idea at all. What are you talking about? Don't get lost down there. I am. I'm already lost. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, this apparition IPA is marvellous. It's uh, it's really, you know, I, I don't. I'm not always a fan of IPAs, but this one's absolutely top top notch. Is it hoppy. It's not too hoppy. I think that's that's probably the thing that turns me off of um, a lot of IPAs is when they just throw everything at it. And... Oh, a slime. Ah, almost never see slimes. Just gonna whack it to bits. There we go. Well, um, uh, so far the the Whitstable Bay Pale Ale is a very summery beer. It's not too, it's not hoppy at all. It's just, um, it's just damn refreshing. Yeah. If it wasn't like nine o'clock in the evening, it, this, it, it would be perfect. <laughs> Let's head back to the ranch. If you're happy to do so. Following you. Lava. Why is there lava there? For pretty. For pretty. Good. Is this upside down? Is it, is it me or is this... A, no, it's, no, I don't know. It just looks wrong. Um, It's a novel design. It was something I was experimenting with at the time. <laughs> okay. Okay. Let's make our way back. Something's going to attack us soon. It's inevitable. Well, I've just been attacked by a slime. It was it was terrifying. I got the impression that you were starting that fight. I don't think slimes even hurt you, do they? Do they? Um, the teensy tiny ones don't. Ah, okay. Right, back to the ranch. Back to the ranch. So it was a. Uh, about this time, on our first or second day, that I built this wheat farm here, which I'm going to briefly walk around. It's called Wheat Dreams. <laughs> Are you there? I'm just here. Yeah. It was oh, guarded oh, by my dog Spartacles. Do you remember Spartacles? Oh, I remember. Yeah, when we were big into dogs. Yeah, can't remember exactly what happened to him. <laughs> Let's assume the worst. Perhaps we should stock up on foods because this is going to be a quite a trek. It is. I'm starting to lose energy. Oh, 
open. Ah! There's a bread in the chest if you want it. There we go. Where's it? What chest? Oh, there's a ch oh, the ch not the chest in the floor. <laughs> yeah, again, it's me experimenting with efficiency. You like your floor chests. So I'm just going to turn all this wheat into breads. There we go. That should be enough to keep us going. I'm going to eat my bread. So the, the next uh, the next item that I'd like to show you is uh, my my what on earth <laughs> my castle in the desert. Oh, the castle! Shall yes. we? Yes. After you. Stupid doors. Oh, I can't even get out. Open them manually. There we go. So this path you made. I remember Did you I? making this. Oh, how industrious! You, you told me about it. You were very proud of it, and. On the day you showed it to me, I just basically stood at the far end of it, looking stupid, while a creeper came up and killed me. Oh, the um, this these doors were the site of amazing amounts of destruction at some point, weren't they? Yeah. Hence why we've got these cactus here. Cactuses. Cacti. Sorry. Cactaroonies. Come and look at my castle. There we go. Up the stairs. So it's... um. It's a bit top heavy. <laughs> but it's got a nice little water feature here. I was quite proud of the water feature. Oh, a rose. And a yellow flower. Should have a little peek from the top. I think the views are good. Let's go. Following you. Got a so great view of your feet now. A little bit of storage here. Nothing in the chest. Well, all the chests are backwards. For some reason, at some point, they've reversed the chests or something. <laughs> so they're all opening in a different way. So yeah, like so many of our houses, we never actually lived in them for any particular amount of time. Generally, we just ended up going back to the ranch, oh. didn't we? <laughs> Did you just... <laughs> Sorry, I was, I was trying to join you and I, I, w I went too far. That's fine, I'll come down the long way. Unless you no, want it's to okay, I'm, I'm, I'm back. I'm back, back, back. I'll, I'll use the other oh, ledge. Oh. One thing. Are you there? Which yes. side are you on? I'm just, I'm just uh, to your right. Ah, so okay. Something. So, hello. So, can Ooh. you see a little hovering cobblestone box, kind of just left of straight? Yes, it's kind of like um eleven o'clock. Yeah, that that I remember that occasion well. We were down in some caves, and we didn't know where we were, and we dug up, and I emerged in that desert. My bearings completely <laughs> lost. And I think I was low on supplies, so I just pillared myself up and hid in that box while the storm was crashing around us. You were somewhere else doing something. You were fine. I think there's also, there's also a little dirt tower um, at about um, 10 o'clock. I think that's one of our many beacons. Yeah. That might even be from a, from a similar occasion. <laughs> one of those things where when you first um, play Minecraft... You tend to just like run around, think everything's fine. The creatures come out at night, and your first instinct is just to make a tower about thirty high and stand on top of it all night. I remember my first single-player world thinking that it was huge, enormous, and building myself all these little towers to guide me, because at the time, I I, I hadn't quite got my head around the idea of navigation. When you're playing Minecraft, you actually really need to concentrate and imagine your really there you need to keep your bearings you need to sort of maintain a little internal map in your head so you know what direction you're going so you know where you are relative to home and, and imagine what this would this, this game would be amazing in oculus rift oh don't <laughs> <laughs> right jamie guess where we're going um to the pub it's close back to the ranch I'm um, I'm currently um practicing my um one-handed Minecraft one-handed drinking beer technique. <laughs> oh no! I, I hit I hit the door. <laughs> you ruined everything. So in fact, we we don't. We should probably make a couple of beds. Actually, let's have a couple of beds for travelling with. In fact, we can just rip up the ones that are up here. What? Yeah, I did. Outrageous! You went there. There we go. So the next thing to look at is your harbour. Yes, Let's, go, let's grab this door, if we can. <laughs> <laughs> These doors are broken as well. 
East gate ah, to out. the harbour. There we go. Ah, the east gate, the brick gate. Closing doors behind me. So, um, you here? There you I are. Am. So the, the lighthouse was uh, actually built after the harbour and after the next place I'm going to show you, but this does still seem like a good opportunity to gaze upon its majesty. It's lovely, isn't it? Do you want to have a look inside or should we do that on our way back? Oh, let's look inside now. Okay. Otherwise it's too much of a tease. I want to see it. This was in the days before they had lots of different coloured wools, I believe. So we had to improvise a bit, didn't we? So it has to be brick and white wool. Pull in Bill's gaff. I. Just also, I mean, we, in fact, we probably would have been these days. We'd use stained clay, I think, because that'd be a bit more robust. And stained glass up here, no doubt. I. Oh God! Look at the torches. Oh, of course, it's the beacon. It's the lighthouse, isn't it? Yeah. Excellent. So I, I don't know about you, but I've, I've got quite a nice view here. I can see the sandstone castle over there. I can see it's the harbour up. and the ranch. And there's the other harbour. I'm on the other side of the, um, the bay. Yep, that indeed is where we're going next. Cool. Well, I shall follow you. No! <laughs> ah! I would normally have suggested that we make a boat, but we're halfway there already. Oh, there's a, there's, there's a creeper on the shore. Just gazing at the sunset. Sorry to spoil your fun, Creeper. Well, what was a sunset? Oh, an Enderman! I wonder if... I don't think they even had Endermen back when we played this map. They did right at the very, very end. Um, we played this game from beta 1.5 to beta 1.8, and it is wow. 1.8 when the uh, the Endermen were added. Should we sleep? Very good idea. Before we hear <sighs> that telltale... Apparently there are no baddies near us, so we should be okay. So, the next place we're going is one of our homes away from home. It was a, the site of a very big caving expedition, and I'm not sure exactly where it is. So there's going to be a little bit of a, a little bit of hit and miss to find the right place, but I know roughly where it is. There's a skeleton here. Ah, uh, we're fine. There's also, oh god, there's, there's a there's few. Two. Ah! Hitting me. Oh, I'm not that well protected. I shall eat some oh. beef. Oh, there was a creeper behind me as well, apparently. Yeah, there's, there's a spider as well. I don't know how I'll, I'll hit the spider. There we go, the spider's gone. Oh, sheep. Sheeps! Now, I think it's probably over this hill. Or around this hill, you can go either way. I'm gonna go over the top and I can have a look. See what's what. Dum de dum de dum. Have a sip uh, of beer. Oh I can see something. I can see a little house. That might well be over it. to the right. Over to the right. Coming. I'm, I'm yes, I'm oh, I'm just having a good old swig. Ouch. I fell too far. Oh, well, there's a path as well. Actually, where are you now? Um, oh, you're back you, on the path. Did you turn right? Um, no, no. Just you're... From the top of the hill, you turn right. So you just need to go around the hill and keep on going. I know you're looking at something. Oh, there it is. Yes, that cobblestone thing. That's it. That's indeed very much Three. it. Oh, look at this. It's also the... um the uh, the Oh, there's so much stuff I remember now. Oh, I'm going to come back to the house, though. Hang on. So, yeah, the, the bit you're house. now looking at was um something, again, you did... Where it's sort of... We could look at it now, but it would be slightly out of sequence. Let's have a look in here first. Oh, so oh, no, oh, I wasn't expecting this. <laughs> so this was another one of our homes away from home, one of our big caving expeditions, and this was our our first real prolonged expedition. I think we were out here for a couple of days, real lifetime, not like hours of non-stop <laughs> playing. But I mean, we weren't that nerdy. You know, we we came over here one day and sort of finished up. A couple of play sessions later. Who of us wrote this sign? Taken most of value to ranch, so Nur. Nur is definitely... <laughs> probably you. It sounds like me. Anything worth having in here? 
Probably not. No, apparently it's all been taken back to the ranch so near. Little bedroom here. It's quite small. It is. Very intimate. What's the sand? What's this sand thing doing here? There's a block, a block of sand. <laughs> I can think of no good reason for that. No, in fact, I, it, it, it offends me. Gone. Where are you? Right, following you, following you. After you. Yep, I'm here. There's water. Water dripping. So, these little towers. We haven't really changed our system very much, have we? Um, no. So the cobblestone tower, that's saying, the torch on that face says, that's the way out. And yeah. the dirt one says, this little branch has been fully explored and all of its resources taken. Oh, this is more complicated than I remembered. It's good, isn't it? I have that torch. <laughs> so many torches. I think we so, overlit the place. <laughs> yeah, well, better safe than sorry. Not you. I'm going to move things around. There we go. So again, we could explore here, but it's a cave. I do remember there being a spectacular... I'm not going to say ravine, because ravines hadn't been added to the game, but there was True. a very nice, large, open chasm. Should we have a little look to see if we can find it? Let's have a look. Uh, I think you again. I'm going to go this way, because I think it might have been a different way out from that main so room. Many, so many torches. I reckon it's this way. You still with me? I am. We actually put some steps in. <laughs> Uh, attention to detail. Steps can also be very useful for knowing when you're reaching civilization. True. Right, I think. Now, this is a long time ago, so I could be entirely wrong. I don't like passing all these dirt markers because um, it's ingrained in me. Don't uh, follow. Don't, get, don't go past uh, the dirt markers. Yep, okay. Wrong oh, way. well. <laughs> oh, I was, well, in this case, I was correct. Yeah. I think at some point I did instigate a new system of using sand, but. Again, it's it's been a while since we played Minecraft. Oh, hey. sorry, that was, I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> that took one my and a half parts slipped. off me. Genuinely, my finger slipped. <laughs> that sounds like the worst excuse. I feel weird without having like the full set of like bows and things like that. I'm going to try up here. Still with me? I am. Oh. Don't worry, I'll shout if you disappear. You got a beard. Yeah, I added a beard. Okay, this is definitely isn't the way to the big open. That is, that's the way out. That's the way out. I, I think maybe, maybe, maybe we're on a, a bit of a fool's errand here. Let's let's take this exit. See what's out there. This might be um, an exit we just use once, so it's in the middle of nowhere. Yeah, I was looking at oh. this a couple of minutes ago actually. So, yeah. if you like, at this point we could take a little look at that area over there that we were just okay. at it's um it's, it's a couple of steps out of sequence on the agenda but you know i ain't too proud Let, let's live a little yeah <laughs> this way come on let's see what i mean about maintaining your bearings yeah we should have brought compasses i wonder if this was before maps it was a similar kind of time actually uh, i think beta 1.6 maps were introduced uh, and we're still a little bit ahead of that, but not by much. So yeah, this is a an area that you <gasps> built on your own. Oh, oh my goodness! This was when I um I I, I still even now I still feel like I mean to finish this. This well, was maybe, the the resort. This was maybe the resort. We could, you know, it's here. It's, it's, it's here. We can finish it. It requires years of work. This, Jamie, 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 Jamie. You, you know my my red clipboard for um yeah. being tour guide. It also doubles oh. up as a nice little sort of this is your life yeah. book, doesn't it? Do, 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 do. <laughs> Clang. This is your resort. <laughs> yeah, it doesn't need much to finish it off, does it? It only needs um it needs everything. What it's a it's a disaster. What's going on? <laughs> there's no paths, there's no anything, it's just oh. I think the the workman's shelter is in here. Let's see if I can raid your chest. Oh, lots of dirt. We're dirt rich. What's that? What's wrong with this chest? It's green to the wall. Do you see that? Yeah, I see that too. This has gone mad. It is a large chest, but it's going into the wall. If you look at the um, 
the outline. Oh, I see. If, what's if you, you can mouse is over where I'm the standing. Rock you can't actually. Yeah, you can't actually get into the gap. I see. Yeah. Things have gone a bit screwy. Well, there's nothing here. To, oh, I'm, I'm going to take the coal. Oh, oh, an iron pickaxe. Oh, I'm having that. This place is my stone pickaxe. Have you got another one for me? Uh, nope. Oh, no, no. oh there's some iron. There's, there's actually some iron in there. So feel free to assemble one. To be honest, I'm not going to be needing much in the way of pickaxe, but I do actually only have a stone sword at the moment. So I'm kind of naked without my full equipment. Doesn't help anyway, I've got no wood. Oh, look, there's a, I, I found a little thing that I made. Hello. It's the um, oh. bizarro behind the waterfall view. <laughs> You've got to have a behind the waterfall thing, haven't you? That's just canonical. That's nice little secret. Yeah. Nice. I said winning through you. <laughs> this game obeys the laws of physics sometimes. 100%. What's that up there? Right at the very top. Oh, some torches. On the very pinnacle of the sand mountain, there's a few torches. Just on the, on, on the, um, the summit. He says as he walks through me. Stop that. Oh, a nice little glade. Again, not quite finished, I think. How dare you. Ah. This is back to nature. I don't have a flint and steel on me, you'll be glad to know. Oh, we could we could burn so much. <laughs> but let's not, because, you know, we might still want to pick up. But all these years later. Yeah. Just think about how much we've learned about building in Minecraft. Well, we could bring horses into it. We could bring horses. Yep. Well, that's, that's the thing, isn't it? When they brought in horses, it kind of made Minecraft... Oh, I can't even say that. Mine carts a bit redundant. But apparently in the next... Um, and I think Minecraft proper 1.8, um, they're actually um, rejigging minecarts to be a lot better. Okay. So they're going to be they're going to be faster on redstone, so they're actually going to be useful again. Yeah, apparently they can go three times as fast, but there's also the risk of derailing on corners. Yes, I saw that. Where are we going? Oh, we're back to, oh, it goes back to here, yes, of course. This this is the actual proper path, which for some reason we didn't follow. Yeah, well, I was trying to take you to that little cave over there. Oh, yes, that's right. Let's use beds. Let's use beds. Um, where's my bed gone? Oh, what's the button? Oh, there we go. Oh, I've, I've just thrown a bone into the ground. <laughs> 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 ah, what's the button? There it is. Cute. Still trying to play Starbound here. So, chronologically, the next thing on my agenda would have been talking about the lighthouse, but we've done that, so that's great. Well, it's, it's just, it's just so, so obviously there you have to talk about it. Yeah. The next place we need to go is the chalet up to the north in the snowy lands. Oh, that's a long way away. Well, we can take the minecart there, um, but that would also take us through a lot of stuff that, you know, shouldn't yet be seen if we are preserving the purity of the chronological experience. So we can either take the minecart there, or we can cut at this point and pick up once we're at the chalet. What do you say? Um, I'm about to spill lots of beer. Hang on. Okay, oh, I'm deciding. God. The, Go head, the head on this beer is enormous. That's what she said. Oh. <laughs> Follow me. 